Hello and welcome to What Tools Inside and this is our point of view. Today we're going to be talking about wine. More specifically, how to open it. Matt, why don't you get us a bottle over there on, All right. the, uh, on the wine rack. Okay. And we're going to demonstrate uh, how this system really works. It is a great system. It's a great gift. A 1967. How does that sound? I like it. A good year. Now, there are a few things. That, why, don't, why don't we open it first? Okay. What okay. you want to do if you this is a nice kit. This is a complete kit for your wine thing. Okay, this is what we're showing you here today. So you put this on here, and this will get, take rid of that. Get rid of that foil. If I had a foil on it, I would do that. Right. It so gets rid of that bottle. Didn't foil. have it. You cut right. that off. Now you, you got to clean. You can access the cork. Right. Right. So then here you go. Here's your cork. Here's your your, your screw bottle. Oh, sorry. Right. My goodness. Now it comes with uh, additional um, cork screws. Right, because sometimes they bend, sometimes they get damaged, you know, whatever. Uh, but look at there's no pre there's no uh, it's not hard to to do. Look at that, no pressure really. It wasn't hard. No, anybody could do it. And there uh, you go. There's the corks out. So now let's say you took this wine out of your cellar, like we're in. Mm. You wanted to check the temperature, because you want to serve wine at a certain temperature depending on the kind of wine that you're drinking. Well, it comes with a little thermometer. Thermometer. That you put, you put that in there, and you and, and you just face it yourself, and you can see what temperature it's at. Right. It keeps going up or down or whatever, or leave it sit there while it, while the tannins are released. If you're if you have the patience, the tannins will be released, and as that happens, you'll notice what your temperature is if it's when it's ready to ready to serve at its optimum temperature. Right. right? So you take that out, you wipe it off. No, not on me. Okay. What the heck is wrong with you? No, I wouldn't do that. You wouldn't. Now, what's that temperature? 400 degrees. Oh, this is in Celsius. This is, uh, so this is, a, it's a 20 degrees Celsius. Too warm. Put it back in the fridge. So the idea is now you're, you, now let's say it's, the, let's say it's, the, it's ready to serve, right? You're ready to serve the wine. Well, there's a couple things that you can do. This is a, it's a little collar that you slide down over the, over the bottle so that when you pour it, it the, does often get down onto the bottle. Right. Right. But you wouldn't pour it like go, directly. Go okay. If you, if you were to do that. You can see that it, that little drip will come down, and you can see where it's dripping. I don't know if you can see it from now, but it's going to get caught in that little, that little uh, thing right there. So this kit, this it's not going to end up down on your countertop. This kit comes with two things. It comes with an air, two two different spouts that you can use. So let's say you're, you're you you forgot to open the wine. You're supposed to open it 45 minutes before dinner, and you forgot because it didn't. Now it's not aerated. Well, put this in. This is an aerator, right? And it aerates. The, the the wine and so it imitates um, it, the, the, the bottle being open for and allowing minutes. it to breathe right it's kind of doing a fast track of that so you can do that or you can simply do this and use this pouring spout with a cork with a cork now you now go ahead and pour that batch whether that, that works I'll pour that in here by the way these glasses uh, beautiful glasses they they have a they're a very like a fine stem Glass, yeah. blown glass, beautiful uh, construction. I like how wide the, feel base, nice. the wide the base is. Actually, yeah, for you need person, to have a nice wine glass. Who spills things? And they come, they come nice and narrow to the top for drinking. Yeah, and nice. it's for the nose. Yeah. So it funnels the smell and right into the. Into so you're the really getting that full aroma of the wine. So and then with this, with this, with this spout, which is nice, is it has a little cork that you just. You just in. put that in there while you're sitting there. We don't want any dust or dirt getting into the. Right. And then finally, let's say you've uh, you, you've. You've had your wine for the night. You're finished. You didn't finish the bottle. You don't want to waste it, but you don't want it to get sour either. So what you need is a, a, a pump to remove the air. So you put this pump in there, and you go one, two, three, four, until it starts to get uh, the air starts to get more pressure. You see how it now pulls it down, right? Then, then there you, you go. Now that's ready for tomorrow. You have another glass. That tomorrow. air has been removed, and it's back like there's a little cork in it. Yeah, and it'll make your wine last a lot. Beautiful longer. little kit, guys. They uh, also check out these glasses. Really nice glasses. They come in a set of four. See, you hear that pop? You like Just that like a cork? And there you go. You've uh, you now can serve wine like a champ. That's our point of view. Thanks for joining. We'll see you next time here on What Tools Inside. Oh, we'll sip a little sip of wine. Would you like to try that? Please.